What's up, YouTube? So, in this video, I'm going to be talking about Levi and Wuzurike. Um, I think I, I think I got that right. Um, defensive tackle out of Washington. I do see him primarily as a three-tack. Uh, he is 6'3 and about 293 pounds. A lot of people say he's undersized. I think it's fine uh, as a three-tack as long as you're around 290 or up. I think that's fine. Um, I wouldn't mind seeing him get a little stronger, though, um, for sure. Uh, but I think that'll happen naturally in the league anyway. Uh, so right off the bat, he is an opt-out guy. I wish he would have played this year because I think he has a lot more to show uh, as far as development goes because I think he is a little bit raw as far as the film we can see now. Um, but he, the things you can see right away is he does have good ball get-off. He does have some athleticism to him. Um, I wouldn't necessarily say he's very powerful, but he does have ball get-off. Uh and he does show the ability to pull cloth. He does get his hands inside, which is nice. But um, he doesn't really seem to rush with much of a plan. Uh, he he tends to try to either defeat your hands and try to go through you, or he'll just try to power through you. But if those two things don't work, he has no idea what to do. If his first plan fails, he's just stuck. Um, and most of the time, he do, he doesn't even like pull cloth or try to defeat your hands. A lot of time, most of the time, he just tries to run down the middle of you. And, um, yeah, it, he ends up just getting stuck. Because, like I said, he's not super powerful to really be able to get away with that all the time. Um, so, I think he still has a lot of football left to learn. I wouldn't really touch him until maybe late third round. Um, but I really wouldn't want him until, day th until like, day three. But, I do think he can be a high ceiling player. Because, like I said, he does have the athleticism. But uh, I wouldn't want him to start right away because, like I said, I do think he needs to get a little bit bigger, a little bit stronger, and he definitely needs to develop more of a pass rushing plan because um, as of right now, I, I think he's mostly just a development guy. But, yeah. But then again, he could go higher this year because 3-tech is such a weak position in this draft class. There just isn't that much talent at 3-tech. So he could end up going higher just because of that. I'm just saying I wouldn't do it. I wouldn't take him until like late third at the earliest. But anyway, that's going to be it for this video. If you liked it, I'd appreciate you hitting that like button. If you have any questions or comments, leave in the comments down below. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.